happened. You know what happened to me? I fell behind because after I saw the Alex Murdoch thing doing doing pretty decent as far as on the page, I started watching that shit like yeah. Sports Center highlights. I was going back and just rewatching it. <laughs> nah, and shout because out to I, you, I good because I'll have more information now because I did watch the Murdoch, uh, the uh, Murdoch murder. Um, a summer scandal. That's that, what it's uh, called. I'm, I didn't a know southern what it was scandal. Name of it I'm was. sorry, a southern scandal. We don't have to give the real name. No, it's, it's on Netflix. Netflix. It's on Netflix. Netflix. It's fire, bro. Just search Murdoch. You're going to find it. No, you had me enthralled. I was like, yo, this is real. It sounded like you was describing like a freaking Batman villain or something like that. And no, I watched it. I was like, story. this is really wild. This That's was one of the wildest stories that they, happened. No, it's really nuts. They, like, they, his, they had the type family like the grandson would call after somebody died in like a car accident. They would clean the whip out. Just yeah. leave the whip there, and they would never go to court. Yeah, I didn't before. watch any documents. Every other thing. adult is taught to call the police when something happens, like an yeah. accident or something like that. They call in their uncle. I knew they were savage when they said <laughs> or their the grandfather son. or something like that. They gonna call him up, get the deets, and they gonna come and sweep it through. Yeah, sweep it out. You remember the girlfriend of the younger son said that when they got in a car accident, and I think one of them got hurt, and the the guy was wilding them and everything like that. The girl was scared, so she called the police. And they said the Murdoch son smashed the phone and threw it in the woods, yeah. yo. And was like, why'd you call you. the police and There's then so call this family? Man. I'm like, this is crazy. I didn't give. I just they was a summary of it. But like I said, this week I've been just focusing on my man. Uh, what was the um, the prosecutor name in the trial for Alex Murdoch? His name was, uh, God damn it. Uh, Creighton, Creighton Waters. Creighton Waters been been he been eating this shit up, yo, because he killed him yeah. on the cross. The cross is like three, four hours long, damn near. I've watched okay. all of it. I've seen it all. You're really gonna be I've a, absorbed. You're it gonna all, be willingly man, a court appointed juror. Yo, I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> <laughs> My brother gonna be in there like, no, the details aren't adding up, Your Honor. Nah, nah, nah. nah it's not sounding be the right. Man. At this point, yo, that yeah. might as well. Yo. <laughs> The Damn. stenographer. The, the way he was lawyer. cooking him on the cross examination is is like a it's a masterpiece so of of lawyership. You know? Lawyers should be looking a at that. I don't even know if lawyership is the word. <laughs> it is the word now. Know. Today it is, but y'all should definitely watch that because he is now he's reeling it in, reeling the dollars in. He said he put mm. his first tweet out in like five years. That should get numbers right now because mm. he went he went in on him. He went in on him like because he just was pointing in at all his lies and shit. They clearly got it. Clearly, the cross is where the cross and the video where they found him down there when the situation happened, like maybe five minutes before the situation yeah, happened. It was nice. He tried to explain that away on the stand. It sounded crazy. And uh, but they're not going to get that off. That's bro. how you know they was so wild to that nigga Creighton <coughs> Waters, yo. For them to have that much money though, they was moving so slippery. Like they'll literally have like a car with like a GPS locator on it, and then tell the police they were somewhere else. I'm like, but yo, the moves, bro. Your car tracks that. They were, <laughs> your phone tracks that. But my they dog. were like, they were clearly high moves. So that's why I'm happy they pointed out the fact he had that addiction. Yeah, the opiates. That was, all of the moves that he made yeah, was, he was gone off made the so oxys. much sense when I heard that he had an opioid addiction. Yo. Man, Immediately, was I was on like, the oxycotton ah, at got like kingpin. Got it. Now I understand what the hell is going on with this crazy ass man, but. Yeah. I didn't see any docs or anything like that, but I definitely uh, listened to a few more explanations and some things of it and, and some clips and stuff like that. And I was like, this is really wild. I it's nuts. Like, I'm glad. It's nuts. He's off the street. Yeah, he had to yeah. Like, <laughs> It's nuts. It's and really nuts. Like, you, y'all should definitely watch like it. Like I said, I know, what I tell y'all yeah. on, the, on, the, on the group chat we had, he got like 100 pending charges still that yeah. he has to face. Gotta he, get these his son up. got something that he might have to face. He had a whole nother situation with the, the other dude. I think his name was Chris something. Yeah. I'm forgetting. Rest in peace to that guy. Um, he might have a whole trial yeah. with that. Yeah. So he and, might be and, going to and jail. And the oldest one is The free. goddamn oldest son might be in the jail with pops. The oldest one is free, chilling. <laughs> It's Low getting real, allegedly. A, allegedly. Allegedly. Allegedly came from a villainous <laughs> background, yo. <laughs> the Murdoughs. Yo, they Murderous Murdoughs, yo. The murderous yeah, Murdoughs is hilarious. Yo, side, bro. Bro, that family been murdering for a long time. That's allegedly. why I told you, they, they so wild, he might be able to survive the cell block on his back, man. You think so? Like, He's I six told four. you. He's 6'4 now, yo. Remember you know, that movie? That. Remember that movie with Buddy that played in uh, Game of Thrones? God damn it, man. I'm forgetting his name right now. But anyway. The mountain? He, no, when he oh. went into jail and he, okay. he became like the leader of the, the Oh, white I don't side. know. You told me about it. I didn't see that. <laughs> we talked about it, I think, on here one time, though. But that's how you're going to have to do. You're going to have to take over that, that portion of the jail. They need to throw all of them at Arkham now. Yeah. <laughs> They definitely got to go, go link up with Batman, bro. He might even be facing charges on the housekeeper. No, the, the thing that was so egregious with the housekeeper was, remember they, 
they allegedly murked her. Then they said they was they was uh, going to accept responsibility for her mis- her incidental death. Then the perked out dad stole the bread. They were supposed to give like the Picked family off. like bread for the for the whole. They he took like, that shit to the dollars. house, <laughs> like four million dollars. He blew that shit on perks, nigga. I was like, yo, this nigga is crazy. He was really on his crackhead Tyrone shit, yo. <laughs> I'm like, yo, this nigga bugged out. He was doing shit that didn't even make sense. I'm like, yo, these niggas be... It's high moves, bro. Yeah, like, you know I'm like, that, they be, they're, they're like... He wasn't even thinking anymore. He just was officials. doing the next move, yo. He was like, fuck it. I'm just going to go hard. Yeah. He was stealing people's all they bring. Not they just they were portion. attorneys, right? Yeah, so I've said that wrong. He wasn't the lead prosecutor. His, mm-hmm. his dad was. They okay. were, they were, And the whole family had led it through mm-hmm. up to him. And he, by the time he was about to take over as lead solicitor, is what the the term is, um, he already realized he had that drug problem. So he didn't do it. But he worked on civil cases. Mm -hmm. I think he worked on like four or five criminal cases, he said, throughout his career. So he's only been working on civil cases. So he might not have that hard of a deal because he didn't put a lot of people in jail himself. Okay. But his family did. Yeah. There's some niggas that's probably been in there for 15, 20 years from his dad. You never know whose family member they killed. That's what I'm saying. It might be somebody in there that'd be like, that was my cousin Lil Jimmy, bro. I feel that I I don't feel for him. He was he was crazy. He was No, he was was wildin', bro. Villainous. Lessons to everybody who was affected by that, because that really is it's it's unfortunate across the board. That's these are like the real like villains that they be creating movies and shows after, and then every now and then you get these in real life, and it's just like that's really really scary, nuts and scary. Yes, yo, people yeah. be having power and money and just be going off the hinges. Everybody not a good person, so Thanks, you know, it's man. crazy. And another dial back too. We Gem of the day. Everybody with, uh, not a good person. Yeah.